You might know. Oh yeah. By the way, um, I tried Infernal difficulty just to see how apparently ridiculous it is, and I managed to do the first level on my first try, which was rather impressive. But I didn't bother doing any more because it took like literally half an hour to kill like whatever they're called, those big guys. Oh! Oh no, not him again. Of course, it did involve me dying like 50 times and just getting lucky enough that my teammates revived me quick enough. But my god, things have a lot of health in Inferno. But yeah, the uh, basically the boss guy of the first level. The big guy took bloody forever to kill. Okay, Lightning. Okay. Yeah. Intel, got uh, I guess I will. We need that base. That's all you're clear to know for yeah, now. A lot of things we need. You heard the man. Take back the base and eliminate all resistance. Would it be fun? Enemies take forever to die. That makes it fun. Uh, they'd, they'd take less to die, probably. I imagine the NPC AI people have, like, crap damage. But yeah, look. Rank 4? When did that happen? Yeah, well, you see. Actually, it probably didn't help that I did Inferno, I think, with this guy. And that's how I got to that level where I was just, like, trying this character, because I thought, I definitely won't be able to do this, but at least I want to see what this character's like. And then I managed to do the, the character, and I got a level and a half from it, because you get more experience. But yeah, I'm not going to use him. He did seem alright, though. Not as crap as I expected. But yeah, I mostly got Jet and Battle, another level each, I think, and unlocked a bunch of weapons. That was the main thing I was doing. I wanted to pick up more weapons so I can try them. But yeah, I suppose so. Maybe. Maybe. But I don't know. The B-O-M-G is truly more of an optimised B-O-M-G. What? Oh. A true total upgrade. I don't remember what weapon that is, but we'll buy it anyway. Might as well just try them. Do I care about shotguns? Are there any that sound particularly cool? The Beehive. Razor sharp homing flat jets. Okay, that sounds cool. Turnbull. Let's try the beehive. Look at that money drain. Here's your waypoint. Right, let's go. Waypoint received. Ravages inbound lightning. Yeah. Take them out. Engaging ravagers. Shotguns just incentivize lazy play. Oh, that's a boring gun. This is a tier three or four gun, it's just an assault rifle. What about the shotgun? Oh, that was boring as well. It's a bit homing, though. So I guess it's pretty good. Oh, look, it's the same game as always. I might not go with these weapons. Oh, yeah. I'll, oh, no. No, I was doing Infernal Difficulty as this character, because I remember finding out about that, which was rather tasty. Oh, floppy fatty. It's pretty cool really, but now let's change the weapons. Those are a bit boring, those are. Run, fat boy, run. Let's any of these sound good? Manufacture. Oh, that is expensive. Oh, it's another BOMG. It's just double exclamation point now. Low capacity. Boa bowl. What about these? Where did these come from? Minigun. Sounds alright. Norwood? 
hot foot. Let's try that one because it's so expensive, so it's got to be good. And. I don't know. Have we got any homing missiles? I haven't tried either of these. Walagus pop star. Cluster of grenades. Super slow missile with explosive energy. Sure. Yeah, I would hope a missile has explosive energy. Here's your waypoint, lightning. Waypoint received. It's just the same thing again. Take them out. Engaging ravagers. Hello? Oh! Oops, sorry, kicker. Oh god, this reloads forever. Oh god, no. I was gonna go with this, but... But I don't think so. Shit, this is impossible. Sorry. Okay, Lightning. We'll find a good down. weapon selection someday. What a good stream. Intel. Got anything for us? Uh, he's he's we a bit too immense. That's all you're clear about to that. Now, Heat seekers into the air. The the right, that sounds pretty distance. cool. And... Does he have any kind of good guns? Let, let's just have the homing one. Yeah, beehive and armor cam. Here's your waypoint, lightning. Waypoint right, this should be fun. Ravages inbound, lightning. Take them out. Engaging ravagers. Whoa! They've gone away. Is this any good? I can't quite tell, but it'll probably do for now. I don't know, some of the wacky weapons will be a pain in the ass because we'll end up killing each other. Just nuke the whole squad at the start of the level. What the hell? Ravager concentration seems to be increasing. Proceed with caution. They're avoiding the enemies more than anything. Who the hell said this character was good? Okay, it did something good there. I thought Craven was a good gamer. I guess it, he must be if he plays this crap character and still wins. They just go all over the place and don't hit anything. Go hit the wasp instead of flying away. You're just killing the city instead. No, fudge that weapon. It's junk, I'm sorry. It's not a tango, it's a wasp. Unless you shot a floating can of tango out of the sky. I don't. Yum. But I want to be the shit teammate. Then the enemies will stay away from me. Unless, but no, bugs do like shit, don't they? What's going on over here, lads? Wacky Alpha something P. Hey look, good, I don't have to rely on these silly weapons. I can rely on a good one. Or they can do it. I don't know what this wasp is doing. Preferably dying. 
What a rainy day over there. Someone's having a bad day on the radio. Yeah, I don't know many. Alpha, Bravo, Tango, Delta, Romeo. That might be it. Rogborth. You got a tick on your mate? No, you haven't. Because you're not my mate. Oh yeah, whiskey. Papa? I think whiskey is one, and Sierra, but I don't know about Papa. I wish I remember what I was using when I was doing some grinding, because it completely destroyed these guys. This big spider. I think Jet had it. Well, this seems pretty good as well, though. Oh no, the gun! Oh yeah, Oscar. Foxtrot Uniform Charlie Kilo Is it Kilo? I don't know. I just remember it from lyrics. I don't know what this spider's doing. I'm having a wonder. There's some good music in this level. Good job, Lightning. Thanks, lady. Decent rocket launcher. Din Desert Rose. Must be held at any cost. Oh, period. Other one. Roger that, Intel. Don't say Digging period. We're detecting wasps, gunships, and multiple carriers. This is Lightning. We acknowledge. Oh, I can't read it. Oh, I wish it had me. Wait, no, I don't. It's a wasp. I wish you could, like, mark weapons as favourites so that I could remember which ones were fun. Oh, God, these ones have got four. There are four lights! I don't remember how he says it, so I'm not even going to try. Oh, they got lasers? No, that was a different ship. Oh my god, aim directly at it and all the missiles go elsewhere. But yeah, actually there was one when I was using jet where I just aimed up and held the fire button. I want that one again. I thought you could see the fire rate mag size and reload. You can with some anyway, maybe. Uh, uh. Did that kill a ship? No. It's just the first level all over again. Oh 
I don't know. Those aren't really the things that, that are bothering me about this. They're just not interesting enough. Like fire rate, mag size and reload time doesn't say anything about the effectiveness of these rockets. Well, that was pretty good. They should add a note. The rockets are crap and go wherever the hell they want. Okay, that's pretty good now. It's working today. I guess it always works. I've just been looking in the wrong places and thinking they're not going anywhere. Going for things that are elsewhere. I don't want these armoured wasps, they're too good. Too powerful for my liking. I want a homing assault rifle. I think there was something that was like that. It shot slightly homing pellets or something. Oh no, it's lip dick again. Oh boy, Muffgeb. Get off him. What's going on with him? He had an exclamation point. He wanted my attention. Well, he got it, and then he didn't want it anymore. I'll look at them all. Too many. That's a big tower that just died. ships back. I don't know if I'm supposed to be killing a ship right now. Looks like it's sticking around this time. Go away other ship. At least the homing is intelligent and it tends to go for the big ship when I aim for it. Yeah, there's a, a big emphasis on the flying enemies in this one. Which I suppose is okay because they don't hit me apparently. My health ain't moving one millimeter. They can't taste the ground, they're spaceships. Yeah. Jet guy is best for everything. But yeah, the... I guess this guy is good for ground battles and just generally exploding everything with his nukes. Boom! Can we salvage the wreck and turn it into a BFG? Oh! Pew! Oh, who died? The world exploded. Come again. What are we being monitored? Okay, lightning, stand by. Let me get to play with the big 
What big toys? Why is there a tree growing on the path? Apparently. Sorry guys, I'm here to ruin your festival tent. Or whatever it was. Oh. Well that was a short mission I suppose. Busy work. She had a mouth slot. Oh. I can't really say any more at this time. What? Are sorting things out. In the meantime, a number of antils have sprung up in your vicinity. Intel thinks that the ravages are trying to mount a counter assault. You're tasked with making sure that doesn't happen. Tanks and mechs are nearby if you need them. I don't. I'm gonna be Jet. Or have I got anything? Wait, he's only rank two. Never mind. Jet and battle all the way. Battle? I don't know what I've unlocked for him. Let's find out. Auto locks one. I don't know what that means. Homing plasma rounds. I think that's something that I've tried already. Seems it's an upgrade for for whatever. Damage and rate of fire. Plas TD. Apparently it's an upgrade. High rebound plasma projectiles. I don't know about that. What about Neptanza Q? Oh, so there aren't that many weapons, just a lot of them are upgrades. Is that good? Bugger knows. Four times fifty one. Sounds good to me, I suppose. We might see Battleman one more time before the end. It probably would be a good time to be him if there's gonna be ants, but Great Plasma Scramble. That's a big description. Zoom factor. I don't know, man. Ravtech Moleculus. That sounds fun. Some of these are like automatically unlocked, or maybe I did unlock them like before I quit the game. Hector robots incoming. Oh, it's this again. Hmm. Nah, no, these ones are too boring. Sorry. I mean, I'll, I like the electric one, but... Apparently, the base wasn't the main objective. Apparently? Well, the base was the objective, but the objective wasn't at the base. Well, let's try that. I can't really say any more at this time. Intel sorting things out. And... In the meantime, a number of antils have sprung up in your vicinity. Intel thinks that the Ravages are trying to mount a counter-assault. You're tasked with making sure that doesn't happen. Uh, go Shrike. Tanks and mechs are nearby if you need them. Uh, 1 times 4 times 107. It's the math gun. Hector robots incoming. Oh. Okay, that one's good. Good at killing me. Are they homing though? That's the question. Yes. Okay, we're going with this one then. Hey look, it's the final boss of the first level that takes half an hour to kill. I was expecting it to be dead by now so that I could have a laugh, but never mind. There we go. You don't even have to worry in, in normal difficulty. 
barely ever die in the first place, but even if you do, they're going to revive you. What an easy game. Didn't even know there was another one. Oh! It's the weapon that kills me more than the enemies do. The Ravager Antil Cluster is waypointed. Get to it, Lightning. I guess I will. That's alright. My rockets will be inbound soon. That ant just came through the building. They think that if they just shove a million enemies on screen at once I won't notice these things. And they can get away with their crap design. But no. I see everything. Oh. Oh right, I've got the jetpack. I forgot about that. It's no electricity shield explosion, but it'll have to do. Man, this gun is rubbish. It reloads forever. And it doesn't even do much damage. Let's not use that. wasn't even marked on the map. Oh, I just realised I haven't got performance mode on. There we go. Sorry about that. Not another shower. Enjoy the naked wetness, Infernal. If you want to. Ooh, Conan. Hopefully it's not Conan. Another spider. can't even be asked to try and remove the ticks. They take too long. As useful as this gun is, it doesn't seem to do much damage. Or at least as much as I would like. Oh, look what the rookie did, achievement. I guess it makes sense. He should learn to enjoy it like I do. Oh, I didn't realise there was another one over here. Whoop. It may not be dragons, but it's still nice and gooey. Where's the last one? Probably over where all the red dots are.
beep boop. I don't know who farted me away. All down. Any remaining ravages. They're not ravagers. I guess ravagers is just the name of the, the bugs in general. How did a spider survive a direct tit from all three? I can only hit them as hard as I've come prepared for. Ugh. I guess probably the main negative thing I would say about this game is like it's all kind of the same. I don't remember if I said this or not, but... Like, sure, there's a bunch of different enemies, but... You're always just in the city. Just kind of mindlessly blowing everything up. As fun as it is... It, it is all just kind of the same. Not much change in scenery. I was kind of hoping maybe there'd be some levels like where you end up going inside a big alien ship or something, maybe. But it kind of seems like it's just one big map. Sort of like if Grand Theft Auto just, like, put you in a different part of the map and put invisible barriers up. And you're in different parts of it each time. Welcome back, Mufgib. Well, you missed some explosions and some ants dying. Wonder how many people these damn things have killed. They've probably killed less than I have killed. That's it. Now pour, it on. pour it on? What do you mean? Are you pouring some ant sauce on your chips? Can I have some? What kind of food did the Mufgeb get? I had half a 12 inch pepperoni pizza and like 10 onion rings about an hour ago hour and a half now, or two hours now which is more than I usually have at once which is probably why I'm very tired but it's alright. I'm awake enough now that explosions have woken me up. I think I also tend to get a bit tired when the cold weather shows up as well, because, like, I wear warmer stuff and it makes me comfortable. So I want to sleep. I'm also just in a very I just want to sleep mood lately. I go through these phases where even though I want to do stuff, I also just kind of want to sleep and not do anything. There's too many games to play, so I'm sorry. There's no time for that. Spicy chicken, yes please. I have a mission. 
Yeah. A mission editor might be might be fun for an EDF game. Although I don't know if there'd even be much variety possible with that. I guess it depends how much freedom they give you. Like, hmm, how can we make a mission that's different? Oh, let, let's put an, an anthill over there. There was never one in that place in the main game. Like, I don't know. I don't know what I'm on about. Like, there doesn't seem like there'd be enough to work with to make interesting missions. Oh no, it's him again. Either way though, it's still fun. Like, it, it doesn't need variety to be fun. He's so meaty. Or metally. Yeah. Ow. Ah. 